Aren't you tired of watching orders get rich while you are missing out? AI is going skyrocket right now and you need to get on board before it's too late. Some channels are making thousands of dollars monthly with AI tools, creating engaging videos effortlessly. In this video, I'll show you how to turn their success into your own. Work smart, don't work hard. Thanks to the power of AI tools, they are making interesting wisdom short videos to keep people watching. Now I know what you're thinking. How are we going to do this? Don't worry, the plan is very simple. We will take their transcript using an AI website called Dub Dub. We will use ChatGPT to modify that transcript. We will use Leonardo AI to generate the images, 11 Lab for the voiceover, and then lastly, we will make the magic happen with CapCut. Stay till the end of this video because that's where I share the secret sauce. Head over to YouTube and search for Living Wisdom. I chose this channel because their videos inspired me to make this one, but you can feel free to browse around and find the channel you like. Pick a video with at least 1 million views and then copy the link and go to dub dub, click on video to transcript where we will paste the link and then now press transcribe then copy the text. Awesome, we've got our transcript. In chat GPT, this is where we are going to rob them. Well, not exactly, let's call it finesse. Type make me another transcript just like this one, but make it look like someone else wrote it so people don't think it's copyrighted. Keep the same ideas, make it simple English and then type here is the reference at the end and hit enter. Awesome. Now let's request ChatGPT to come up with a set of prompts to generate images in Leonardo that align with the story. Beautiful. Now we got our prompts, let's go to Leonardo, proceed to generate the images by clicking the image generation section and then paste the prompt that we got from ChatGPT there. By the way, here's a quick tip. If you add hyper realistic at the end of your prompts, the image quality will be better. Click on image guidance, reduce the strength to around 20, then click generate again while maintaining the same prompts. This way Leonardo will attempt to keep a consistent style, making it effective for creating a storyline with similar images and then download the images. Now for a voiceover, go to 11lab, paste the story, choose your voice preference. Mine is Adam. Play with the settings if you want to, but mine is already set the way I like it. And then when you're done, hit generate. Lastly, download the voiceover. We're almost done. We got our script, we got our images, we got our voiceover. Now let's go to the animation. It's extremely easy. I remember back in the day, you would need to be a professional to do this, but not anymore. With the help of AI, you don't need to go to school for years to animate an image. Go to Runway ML and make an account. This website is free for beginners but again if you are serious about this you will pay for the subscription. Also very important guys click on general motion change it to 8 so your videos can be smooth and then click generate. Do the same for all the other images. I'm gonna fast forward this part because it's a little longer. Fantastic! Our animation is ready. Now let's open CapCut to start our editing. We're gonna start by importing all the videos including the voiceover. Drag and drop the audio first to the timeline. Make sure you cut out your audio pauses because if you don't people will click off and you will not go viral. Let me fast forward this part because it took me 10 minutes to do. Awesome! Before we add our videos to the timeline, make sure you click on aspect ratio right here. Change it to 9 by 16 because as you already know, we are making a short video. Alright, now add all the videos to the timeline. And guys, if your videos are too short, you can change the speed to make them longer by going to the right side of the screen. Click on speed, change it a little bit so your voiceover is not longer than the video. Again, I'm going to fast forward this part because it's a little long. Perfect. Now that we have our videos ready, the next step is transition. And for the transition, we are going to the left side of the screen, click on transition, scroll all the way down until you find black fade. I use black fade because I like how it looks, but feel free to choose any transition you want. Drop the transition between all the videos. Beautiful. Now that we are done with the transition, we will do some color grading. To save you guys some time, we are going to just add a filter. Click on filter, scroll all the way down until you find a filter named clear too, which will make the appearance of the video look clean and brilliant. Now that we are done with filter, we will move forward to the very important step which is caption. Same thing again, left side of the screen, click on text and then auto caption. Choose the language, mine is English and then hit create. Perfect. How easy is that? We are all done guys. Before we go ahead and watch the final result, feel free to add some music in the background if you want to. Stay away from copyrighted ones. If you want to know where to find copyright free music, leave it in the comment section and I will make another video about it. Now let's take a look at the final result. Once upon a time, there was a lady who had some doubts about her husband. She often thought he might be seeing someone else behind her back. One day, she asked him, Do you really love me? He replied, Absolutely. But she didn't believe him and got upset, then left in a hoof. 
Even though the man tried his best to prove his love, she never trusted him. Years went by, and they had their first child. Yet, she still suspected him of cheating. One Sunday day, they were strolling in the park with their newborn when suddenly she stumbled and hit her head. She woke up in a hospital room, disoriented. What happened? Why am I here? She cried out. A nurse hurried in and reassured her. You had a nasty fall, but you'll be okay. Then she asked about her baby. Where's my baby? He's safe in another room, the nurse replied. When she saw her baby alone, she jumped to conclusions. I knew it. My husband abandoned our baby because he's cheating on me. Confused, the nurse asked. What do you mean? The lady explained. When I fell, my husband must have left the baby to be with another woman. Concerned, the nurse said, wait a minute. When you fell, your husband actually saved your baby from a car. He pushed the stroller away just in time, but he got hit instead and didn't make it. If you enjoyed this video, feel free to drop a like and then punch the subscribe button for me. The resources that I use to make this video and also the secret sauce are in the description. Check them out. Stay tuned for the next video. Peace out.